it all started with us in high school sitting in a hot tub. We were young and, you know, we had a dream. Brett Salk and I we were, you know, best friends. We grew up playing hockey on the same hockey teams. We used to talk about opening a brewery, but at that age, that sounds really cool, but we didn't really know what that even meant. It just sounded cool because we liked drinking beer. But as we got a little bit older, when the opportunity actually came about, it all stemmed from talking about it just almost as like a, a pipe dream idea that didn't ever seem like it would come real, but ended up happening, you know, six, seven years from those hot tub days. Really was kind of wild where things went. My name is Alex Dirksen. I am born and raised in Jasper, and I am one of the owners of Jasper Brewing Company. Back when we opened, craft beer wasn't a thing. People had no idea what an IPA was. They weren't used to different flavors. That even went for me. It took everyone a while to get used to the culture of craft beer. You know, it was so tight the first 24 months that we weren't taking a paycheck. We were just living off our credit cards. We would, you know, work all day, all night, and go through the same routine seven days a week for a couple of years. It was a real reality that we could have went out of business. So 12 months in, the Oilers made the playoffs. They clinched on the 81st game of 82 games, so they shouldn't even have really made the playoffs. So they were extreme underdogs. And we turned into the, the playoff central spot for Oiler games. Then every second night, with Edmonton winning, it slowly turned into something that we never expected. Inside is just going absolute crazy. The support we got from the community and the playoff run that year saved the business. There's a reason that um, we're doing business in Jasper. I think Jasper is a really easy town to grow up in. You're a five minute bike ride from the, the school for kids. I'm a three minute bike ride from work. You can still get a dining scene that's comparable to a city. We owe a lot to the team that works in their day-to-day. -day. The guy that's pouring your pint, the, the brewer that's brewing your beer, the kitchen staff that are cooking the food you're eating. We could not have the level of success that we have now in Jasper without uh, what the community has done for us. And when I look back the last 18 years, I think it's pretty crazy that our childhood dream actually came true.